as we've studied before in the first month of the year what constellation is the new moon found in every year without fail Sefer Yetzirah 5 and 2 the Jewish rabbinical writings details the 12 divisions of the heavens and the 12 months with the first one being Aries so from the ancient rabbinical writings we can see that the new moon must be in the constellation of Aries for that first day of the first month of the new year if we know that the constellations are a huge story in the heavens all about Christ then we can see how this makes sense in the Bible those constellations have been perverted by Satan in an effort to obscure this message those constellations are not about you and your story what's going to happen next in your life that story up there is all about Jesus Christ so when we get to the beginning of the year the constellation of the ram this part of the story reminds us that this is the month in which Jesus Christ became our ram in the bush we get a better understanding of this when we review the story of Abraham when he was taking Isaac up to be sacrificed and God provided that ram in the bush we see this in the book of Genesis chapter 22 and verse 13 and Abraham lifted up his eyes and looked and behold behind him a ram caught in a thicket by his horns and Abraham went and took the ram and offered him up for a burnt offering in the stead of his son Jesus Christ was offered up in our stead y'all seeing this in the month of that ram symbolic of what the month is all about the Old Testament foreshadowing of this is the Exodus remember the firstborn male was to die as God told Pharaoh to let my people go watch this now the firstborn male was to die and the only way for the penalty of death to pass over was to have the blood of the lamb on the doorposts of the house this lamb had to be a male a male lamb is called what a ram I hope you're all seeing this the ram has a purpose and God was going to do it in a certain month and he would do it as he had outlined it within the Leviticus chapter 23 feasts that's why those day counts are there because he will fulfill on those days at the appointed time all right I will leave it right there till we meet again live holy before the Lord love y'all Shalom